Each of the 54 Titan II missile bases across the U.S. were designed to the same standards and were nearly identical to one another. All had an escape and ventilation shaft which was 3 feet in diameter and nearly 60 feet deep. The shaft was made of heavy gauge corrugated culvert material with a concrete transition at the top 4 feet. When decommissioned, the complexes surrounding Tucson had to meet strict dismantlement standards. All escape shafts were to be filled with concrete grout, leaving it all but useless and inaccessible. Site 571-4 to the southeast of Tucson illustrates this with part of the escape shaft laying on its side, completely filled with grout. Others have painstakingly chipped their way through the grout to about 35 feet deep to make access through the ventilation portion of the shaft. They cut through the emergency plunger assembly and made their way into level 2 of the launch control center. Our goal is to make entry through the access portal, opening for the long cable way and also through the escape or ventilation shaft. As explained earlier, our site had concrete grout filled to the top of the shaft, meaning that we have roughly 35 feet of solid grout to jackhammer and remove bucket by bucket. It usually takes about one hour to jackhammer and remove six inches of grout. At that rate, it should take about 70 to 80 hours to gain access to the launch control center.